Good morning, everyone. Welcome to a day in my life. Today is going to be a pretty interesting day. I have some stuff to do, so I thought I would take you guys along with me. So right now I'm just getting ready, just doing a little bit of minimal makeup. Thought I'd do a little chit chat, get ready with me. Okay, first off, we hit 5,000 subscribers. That is so crazy. We just hit 4,000 a couple days ago and I could not thank you guys enough. I am so happy so appreciative of all of you guys thank you so much i was looking at my youtube analytics and i was looking at what was happening with my channel a year ago and a year ago on this day i had like 14 subscribers which is so crazy that we've grown so much over the past year so thank you guys so much for subscribing this youtube journey has been so fun and i can't wait to see where it brings me anyways today i have a few things to do i have a zoom call with a company which is super super exciting another thing i have to do is edit some instagram pictures i also have to schedule some videos and some content for the next few weeks because i have so many ideas and things that i want to do but i need to actually put it into my schedule and see what makes sense timing wise i'm just doing super minimal makeup today just because i do have online school and i have a zoom call and i want to look presentable so so it's currently 902 and because we hit 5,000 subscribers and it's a special day i think we should celebrate and order some starbucks okay i'm gonna get a frappuccino just because it's really special hit 5,000. it's a milestone i want to celebrate and i want to get into the tradition of celebrating my milestones just because i'm really appreciative of everything that you guys do and all the love and support you guys give me i want to celebrate every time we reach a milestone i get so concentrated when i curl my eyelashes so i have been breaking out so much over the past like week trying to get that under control so i also have online school in a, in a few minutes so that's why i'm ordering starbucks because i don't have time to like go out and get it okay i'm gonna order something from starbucks what do i want okay so i think i'm going to get do i want a coffee okay i'm gonna get a frappuccino and I'm gonna get a breakfast sandwich as well. Okay, so my Starbucks is ordered, it should get here soon. I'm going to join my online class and then get my Starbucks when it gets here. Okay, so my Starbucks order is gonna be here in like two minutes. So I'm gonna go to the door and get it and then go back to online school. Okay, I've got my Starbucks. Oh, they're so cute. They wrote they wrote good morning on it. That's so cute. I feel like Starbucks workers, at least the Starbucks that I go to, they're like the nicest people in the world. Okay, first, of course, I got my Frappuccino. Oh my gosh, this is my favorite Frappuccino. It is the Mocha Cookie Crumble Frappuccino. So good. And then for breakfast, I got the sausage egg breakfast sandwich, delicious. And I got this lemon loaf as well. This actually isn't for me, this is for my dad because he really likes this. So I'm gonna save this for him. So yeah, I don't usually get Starbucks for breakfast, obviously because it's expensive, it's not really good for you, but I figured since we have 5,000, I should treat myself and just give myself a little reward. So I'm gonna eat my breakfast. I have online school right here. I actually muted it. So um, I hope I'm not missing anything. <laughs> guys so i'm just in my bed right now i have a half an hour break from school i made some lemon water sadie posted a new video so i'm going to watch that i feel like in every video i share one of my favorite youtubers and one of my favorite youtubers right now is sadie Alvis. she makes such amazing videos Okay, I have the most gorgeous lilacs in my backyard and every year I cut some off of the tree and like put it in a glass of water, bring it into the house, make the house smell really good and 
it's like it's already wilting it's been a few days but they're starting to wilt which is so sad because i love them so much but lilacs don't last that long anyways even when they're still on the tree so i feel like it's worth it to take them in and enjoy them for a little bit but yeah i put on some necklaces this necklace is from shein i believe and then this necklace is from anna luisa this ring is from Every Jewels. This ring is from Shein as well. Right now, I'm going to edit some Instagram pictures. If you are not following my Instagram, you definitely should. I'm gonna show you guys how I edit my Instagram pictures. No one really asked for this, but I feel like it'll be fun to show you, so yeah. First, how I take my Instagram pictures. A lot of the time, my mom will help me take Instagram pictures, which is really, really great. But if I do take self-time pictures, which I do relatively often, because I like to have a lot of content to post on Instagram, Taking self-timer pictures might seem a little bit frivolous, but I promise you, with a little bit of practice, you'll get really good at it. Some tools that help me take self-timer pictures is number one, this remote. It's this tiny little shutter button, and this is Bluetooth, and it connects to my phone. So all I have to do is click this button, and it takes a picture from my camera. This is a lifesaver because if I'm taking self-timer pictures, all I have to do is set up my phone on my tripod and just go crazy and click a bunch of pictures instead of pressing the button, running, getting to the frame, and then like, you know, it's kind of awkward like that. I got this on Amazon. I will link it down below if you're interested. If you want to take self-timer pictures, this is definitely worth it. This, this looks very weird because I actually broke it, but this is part of a selfie stick. Just put your phone into the little part and then it has this twisty part at the bottom so you can twist it and put it onto a tripod this tool is great for putting your phone on a tripod obviously super worth it if you don't have a tripod for your phone you can get a selfie stick for like super inexpensive some of my favorite locations to take pictures is like parking lots because most of the time they're relatively secluded so you don't get embarrassed in my backyard is also a great place that i love to take pictures and just at parks because most of the time when you're at a park people are just minding their own business and just getting on with their day so you're not gonna have people staring at you for the most part i edit my pictures in visco i don't actually post on visco pretty much just use it to edit i pretty much edit all my pictures the same but i just change up the numbers on each picture depending on the lighting and stuff like that so i'm gonna take this picture this is a self-timer picture i took in my backyard the other day i like how this is cropped already so i'm not going to change the cropping but i will go into exposure bring the exposure down by like one then i will go into contrast bring the contrast down by like one it honestly depends on the picture this picture has pretty good lighting so then i will go into sharpen just sharpen it a little bit maybe like two depending on the picture again saturation maybe about one this picture does have good lighting so it doesn't really need to be saturated that much then we have tone and highlight this is like my favorite part of editing the highlights i will usually bring that up like almost halfway maybe around four or five depending on the picture again and then shadows just a little bit up because if you go too much then it looks like that which actually looks pretty cool but it doesn't really match my instagram feed and then that's pretty much it that's actually how i edit all my pictures edit my instagram stories like that i edit my instagram pictures my thumbnail pictures everything i kind of edit the same way hopefully that was helpful if you are wanting to edit pictures Hi everyone, so it is 11-11, make a wish. So I have my little meeting, my Zoom meeting in three minutes. I just want to show you guys my little setup for when I do company Zoom meetings. I want to be super organized. Don't mind this pimple right here. So first we have my phone on this little stand. It's just a little stand from the dollar store, super handy. Then of course we have my laptop. I'm just going to open Zoom. And then I have this notebook right here so I can write notes in it with a pencil. And then of course I just have my lemon water. I love writing notes by hand just because I feel like it's more, I don't know, I feel like it's more tactile. Like I just like using pen and paper or this is a pencil but you know what i mean yeah i'm gonna join my meeting and i'll talk to you guys after my meeting so i just finished the meeting it went really really well the whole time i was in the meeting though i realized that my clothing rack is so empty mostly because i'm wearing most of the clothes that are on it and a lot of the other clothes are in the laundry so i think i'm going to add some more clothes to this to make it look a little bit less empty and make it look cuter So right now, 
now I'm going to spend some time to plan some content. Seriously, I talk about lemon water in like every video, but it is so good. It's like, it's almost like lemonade, but it's like not sweet, if that makes any sense. I'm going to start editing. I have a few things to edit actually. And I also want to take a thumbnail picture for this video. So I'm going to play around with some different angles and get editing. So it's currently like five o'clock and I thought I would end this video right here because I actually have a video that I just posted last week about my night routine. So if you wanna see what I would do after this point of my night, you should definitely check out that video. It'll be linked down below. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you subscribe and follow my Instagram. Give this video a thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next video. I love you all so much. Thank you again for 5,000 subscribers. Bye everyone.